By the end of this video, you will be able to delete multiple channels at once within FL Studio. Let's get started. So you're going to want to have FL Studio open, and you probably notice that when you drag and drop your samples into FL Studio, it will also add them to your channel rack, uh, which contains the step sequencer. So there might be times when you want to delete all the unused uh, channels within your channel rack. So in order to do this, you're going to want to make sure you click on your channel rack and then go up to tools on the left hand side of your screen. And then you're going to want to go to macros. And then you're going to want to find the selection for select unused channels. So I'm going to click on that and you can see that all the channels that I'm currently not using have turned green. And again, that's it shows up right here with these little green squares. And so now what I want to do is delete those unused channels. So in order to do this, I'm going to go up to this drop down arrow right here and then I'm going to click on delete selected. And when I do that, it's going to ask me the selected channels are about to be deleted. Are you sure you want to do this? And then I'm going to press OK. And then you can see it deleted those unused channels. Uh, the shortcut for deleting unused channels you probably notice is when you have delete selected, Alt Delete would also do that once you have them selected. You can undo this now in FL Studio. So if I want to undo, I can go up to Edit and then Undo Delete Channels. And then it will bring back the channels and everything that I was working on as well. So I've got that back. So now those are back. So if for any reason you deleted a channel and you want to get that back, you can uh, undo that. That's how you can delete all the unused channels at one time with one click. You can also delete the unused channels one at a time. And in order to do that, all you need to do is just select the channel you want to delete. It'll turn green as seen there. And then I'm going to go up to that drop down arrow again and click on delete, delete selected. And then it will ask me again, I'll press OK. And you can see you can delete them one at a time as well. Um, but this video is mostly to show you how to delete all your unused channels at one time. So you now know how to delete multiple channels within FL Studio with one click. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other FL Studio tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you and I'll see you in the next video.